What's up guys, good afternoon. Uh, I got back in town a little bit early. I uh, don't have work today, I got it tomorrow. So my uh, red LED lights that I got for my dash and my uh, gauges up my A-pillar came in. I'm gonna give you a how-to video on how to take the dash apart uh, to get to your instrument cluster and change the bulbs in there. I've never done it before, so it might take me a little bit, but bear with me and hopefully y'all can learn something. So stay tuned. Alright guys, so this is held on with two screws at the bottom, which go right here, and then it's just, it just has these pins, or clips that just hold it in, so it just pops off, and then if you have the adjustable pedal, uh, it'll unplug right here. So guys, so I got all the lights installed and as you saw from the previous clip, I forgot one bulb. I miscounted there are 11 bulbs back there and I ordered 10. So looks like it will be coming apart yet again after that new bulb comes in, but I can live with it for now. Um, still need a light in there. It's my fuel gauge, so need to know how much fuel I have. Uh, but uh, a few things, just if you want to do this for yourself, it's the B8.5D LED. Um, I got mine from superbrightleds.com. They have really good prices. Shipping isn't bad either. And they got really, really fast service. I get, I ordered it on Sunday. It got here on Thursday, I think, uh, just with standard shipping. And another thing is just make sure that you um, know when you plug it back in, some of them probably aren't going to work because LEDs are polar sensitive. So... If they're not working, just pull it out, flip it 180 degrees, put it back in, and it should work. So there's a, I had to take it in and out, plug it in and uh, back in and take it out and everything like six times until all the bulbs got working. It's a little bit tedious because uh, you're working in a tight space, but it's so worth it. And the reason I went with red, one, because it matches the truck. Two, because red um, affects your night vision the least out of all the colors. So um, easier to see at night, late driving. It's not going to affect you as much as a white light does. Uh, like I used to have and a lot of people have on these pillar gauges. They were super, super bright, but now they're not that bad. Um, you can also go with a lower wattage too. I went with a 0.5 watt. Um, so it's not quite as bright, especially with an LED. It tends to be uh, brighter anyway. But I hope you guys enjoyed this upload. I hope you have a merry, merry, merry Christmas. I'll probably do another upload uh, before Christmas, maybe two. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like this video, and stay tuned for what's to come. See ya.